I was telling Mama that if we carry on, uh, because we need to have 50 here and then 100 outside, I said we we'll end up, we have a very big land now. We'll end up having a church outside, inside the cars. I was telling Mama that, that we we'll end up making church here, cars there to there. I was telling my mother that. Because I know whatever that is happening, which I want to tell you is not good. I think I've been talking about this. I've been talking about this, that the idea here is to stop the church. The idea is to stop the church. Because if the church can stop, I'm telling you, Satan will come up. Antichrist will start to work. That's the idea. The idea, pastors, is to stop the church. Why Corona is so powerful in South Africa? I've been asking myself. Where it has started is very weak. Why is it so powerful here? Did you ever ask yourself that? This that is happening, uh, I don't know. I think uh, we need to pray for our president. How does he know uh, this third wave? Or third wave is coming? I don't understand that. Very soon, you'll hear the fourth wave is coming. Why this thing is happening to our country? <clears throat> Do you know this thing is going to raise people who are wrong to take over the country? There are some people that are not supposed to take over the country. But if we carry on say this, that wrong people will rise up and take advantage of this weakness. And whatever will happen now, people will be crying. They, you remember what happened by the time of Corona? People were suffering, losing jobs. We don't want to see this thing again. I pray that, you know, our president can see the way people are seeing what they saw. They don't want to see it again. The pain of losing jobs, the pain of suffering, no support, problems. Shops close. People are affected, rents. You're supposed to pay rent, you're supposed to pay a car. Many people lost many things. There's nobody who wants to die. Are you hearing me? Eh? If people see that corona is killing people, they'll be serious. They'll be serious, they'll wear their mask, they'll do everything which is necessary. But if we just say, now, hey, stage one, stage five, stage, this thing will kill people, will affect our government. Even the wrong people will kill other people and say it's corona. And the, this is the time where Satan want to work. No. We are giving Satan chance and we are fearing him. Than to stand up and say, like what is happening in Tanzania? Like what is happening in Tanzania? I was told by one of my pastor in Namibia, he said they are allowing only 10 people in the church. <laughs> If it's 10 people, pastor and his wife, and two children, and six favorable, favorable members, and now it's a church. Satan is waiting for a church. Let's stand up and pray for the church. Can we do that? Huh? Can we pray for the church? Huh? Say in the name of Jesus. We want to raise our voice and one voice that Jesus, the same Jesus who did mighty works can stop the plan of Satan in our countries and the church of God will prevail. Can we just pray, 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 pray. Let's pray. The church of God must prevail. 
God must raise mighty people. Oh God. In Jesus' mighty name. Can we pray for our leaders? Our president. The president we have is from Venda. We vendors, we are very intelligent. Sometimes we don't need to use our intelligence. We need to hear God. Let's pray for our president, for our leadership in our country. Hear prayer. Father, thank you for the leadership. We pray for president. We pray that you give him wisdom. Pray louder, pray louder. Oh, Father, remember us here. Oh, Father God. Raba Babasi, ta ta ta. Raba Kata. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen.